Well, hello everybody. This is Colin Blow coming back at you. Just uh, bringing you a cool uh, new plugin I got. I noticed that <coughs> they released a new roulette wheel in the little bandit town area. Um, thank goodness I went the other direction two weeks ago and started playing around with the slot machine instead of the roulette wheel. I would have been in some trouble. But here we go. The biggest things. Once you get permissions, just to play slots, chat. You can also bind the key to that. It's a console one called Play Slot. Same thing. Much easier. You can toggle it on and off real quick with a uh, key bind. All right. Biggest thing that, you know, if you want to just play, you can. Here's the console here. Just kind of a quick overview. Uh, over here on the right, you get your basic thing. This is your move button. If you want to move it, toggle that. WASD moves it around the screen. You can move it wherever you want. Make it easier to here we go and check it. There we go. Leave it up there. So pretty cool. Now let's say this let's play. Now the two options you have here. You got you can use RP points or you can use um, items. Just click the button. It'll switch to items. It'll tell you how many you have on you. We got two thousand, and it shows up correctly. So I want to bet. Let's say let's do it. Let's do a hundred at a time. Spin here. And it makes a little beep. Beep, 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 beep. It's spinning. Oh, it didn't win. Darn it. Spin again. Another 100 bit. So it takes it instantly from you whenever you hit the play speed wheel. If you don't win, if you win. You can also bind a key. Uh, the console command to spin the wheel is uh, roll it. Bind it to whatever key you want, and you can just hit it like this while you're just farting around. There you go. Okay. Super so win on this one. Oh. Okay. Another big thing is uh, you can say, well, how do I win? So you get the pay table, the dollar sign here. That's your pay tables. Uh, top line is your jackpot line, I guess you could say. And then you got the sevens, the triple sevens line, bar three line, bar two, one bar, or whatever, any bar line. Page 12. This is your cherries or there's apples for this theme. Uh, three cherries, four apples, two apples, or one apple. There you go. Now you can change the theme, which basically changes the pictures. Theme one is default. Theme two is more of a mining theme. Let's cycle through the ores, stuff like that. And just give somebody something else to do. You know, here's your pay table for the mining one. Get the mother load is your jackpot. You know, pickaxes it goes all the way down to cherries is your stones, you know, and then all the ore nodes. Okay. Let's see here. Alright, we go this bag in. We gotta win something. Okay. Maybe the next thing we like to do rings and it also shows you down at the bottom a little info tip that you wanted those for one cherry right there okay let's change theme to the food spin the wheel right. different food items and meats basically not food there we go. this one's got its own pay table as well there you go you got the buffet which is your jackpot your pork loins three two one any and then the little chicken <laughs> there we go Change it back to RP points. This is how many are current RP points the player who is spinning has. It takes it away and puts it back immediately. So you don't have to cash out or anything like that. Alright, let's, let's close it out here. And like I say you can also bind a key to toggle open and close the thing really quick and easy. So you can open it and start playing. Here we go. I'm going to change it back to scrap. Do, uh, do a pretty good one here. What do we got now? There we go. Oh yeah, see? There we go. Just want some scrap. Oh, I'm rolling in the dough. Alright, now let's uh, toggle over to the config file real fast for you guys. Alright, top of line here we got the bit increment. This is how much it, uh, whenever you press the up or down plus or minus for the bit, that's how much it increments by. Currently it goes up by five or down by five. This is a 
item ID for scrap. You can change it to anything you want. If your server uses something else for currency, you can change it to that. Uh, that's the item ID. This is the, the, basically the start bit five. So still it's not zero. <laughs> now here we got right here. We got the global. It's basically this right here. Allow only allow slots to be played in the bandit town area. Uh, it doesn't necessarily have to be sitting in here where I'm at now, right here. It can be anywhere in the Bandit Town area. So now I could maybe in the future I could have an option where you have to be sitting in one of the chairs. That might be kind of cool. But uh, here's the payout multipliers. This is your jackpot multiplier. This is your triple sevens, basically the second highest payout. This is your bar three, three bar threes, third highest. Bar two, three bar twos, you know. Bar one, any bar, three cherries, two cherries, and then one cherry. And that's the same thing as the uh, on the payout screen here. If you notice, that's the jackpot. It'll match that perfectly. Of course, if you change the numbers, then you know you might have to change the picture. <laughs> Here's the theme pictures for all of them. Here you go. This is the default theme. You can change all the icons for the reels for each, you know. The one bar picture, two bar, three bar, the blank, the cherry picture, which like on the default theme I have is the apple, and the jackpot theme, and then the, this is the machine skin, this is the inside here, a little inside piece, change the theme, you notice it changes as well, it's got like a little rocky theme, and this one's got kind of a, looks like a fireplace, you know, it's a campfire in the background, so that's what that one is. The pay table, that's the little picture of the pay table. Sevens is triple seven skin. You know, just change it all you want. Here's the meats, and then the mining. So that's basically the rundown on that. Oop. And there you go on that one. So, like I said, you know, if you want to play, just play slots. If you're authorized, or use the quick, just make a quick bind and then start playing. And hopefully, hopefully we get a jackpot. One more roll. Let's see how we win. There we go didn't win nothing. All right. Well, you guys take care and I uh, hope you enjoy.